Hi, my name is Chiki and I am the everyday dude. I did my apprenticeship in Spain as a motorbike mechanic uh, and I ended up working on a workshop fixing motorbikes. Uh, working in a couple of bikes I saw a few motorbikes with a really good paint jobs and uh, that's how I started that way. I should do this. I started doing uh, mainly airbrushing um, and then I moved into pin striking and lettering called it. Um, especially when I moved to Australia, um, I really like the hand painted signs and gold leaf that I saw everywhere. And I just learned the trade, bought, bought some brushes and bought some enamel paint and started practicing. Back in Spain, uh, when I started 17 years ago, uh, I couldn't find anyone to, to teach me. And uh, pretty much just watch a few videos and, and, and just learn. My favorite project was uh, working in a Volkswagen Beetle. He have a really old paint job, it's really distressed, and I did some lettering in both doors. Um, once that the lettering is done, the day after uh, I scratched it and make it a bit edge. I really like the project of the Beetle because uh, I mix two types of letterings. Uh, the top is script and the bottom is all done in, in block, block letters and it just looks really good uh, over the distress of the platina. I did a really good project for Triumph. Uh, we did some instructing in a lettering in a Triumph Bonneville. Uh, for the distinguished gentleman ride, um, and that was really, really, really good. We did the logo of the distinguished gentleman ride on the front, uh, and then we did a bit of pinstriping in the front fender, and and more pinstriping in the both cars. The Impala was a really good project. Uh, just a really cool car. Uh, you already have a really good uh, flake job and I did a uh, scroll pin striping uh, front and back, a couple of colors white and ivory and I really really enjoy doing that car, especially when the car is, is really good. I really enjoy painting anything. I like to do murals, I like to do in front shops, signs, um, cars, motorbikes, helmets, anything can be painted and customized. Final signs peel off. That's what's happened. Hand painted signs, they stay there uh, for a long time. And they become part of the part of culture, part of the, the art of the street. They then them properly. Finally, this is, I don't know, it's, it's too perfect. It's, it's no imperfections, it's no, it's, it's all cut by a computer and it's uh, done by a phone that someone has created. So it's, it's got no personality, it's got no, no, no passion, it's got, yeah.